Well, hello everyone. I wanted to give you guys a tour of my quarantine office setup. A lot of you guys have been asking for this, so I figured I would just show you around a little bit in the office, give you a little bit of a detailed look of what I need on a day-to-day -day basis to do my job. My actual job title is a process engineer. And what that means is I interpret drawings from design engineers and calculate out material for it to be fabricated. That's kind of the easiest way to describe it. So basically I look at prints and drawings all day as well as I do a lot of math. So that's kind of what I do and it's all, not all of it's data entry, but a, mo a majority of it is uh, data entry and entering it properly into our systems to make everything work. So this is my second bedroom and this is now an office. I used to have it as a guest room, um, but I converted it into an office quite a while ago. Um, as you enter, we're going to look down right now because Doyle is there sleeping, doing his due diligence as the co-worker. And um, let me give you like a little desk tour. Right now, um, since we're dealing with COVID and all of that stuff, I have like a little heart thing. Um, I actually got this on Amazon. Uh, yesterday this came in. It's like a little rope um rainbow and i thought that was really cute so um you know i have my little my cute little valance here so yeah um i'm gonna link as many things as i can find down below for you guys um over here actually let's start with this wall so clearly this is not required but i have these prints on the wall i got them from home goods i believe like home goods or marshall's i can never remember which one but i got them at the same time they're beautiful they've got like some sparkles on them and i just love like the gilded frame i think that's so so sweet and so pretty anyway um over here i have a little envelope um opening thing i have right now just a little book in there but i actually do keep um like my paper bills in there anything that gets mailed to me that i have to like financially take care of i will put in there as a reminder and then when i deal with it then it goes in the file cabinet which i will show you in just a moment um i have two of these lamps which are on both sides flanking got those from Ikea I also have this little funny looking thing um that is a tripod like I can actually put my camera right here it's like a little mount um I will link it is actually already linked below but it works really well for my setup when I you know do planning videos and such um, over in the corner here are my planners that I got in PR that I have some things I need to do with or like deal with with them. I also have um, some stickers that I'm going to be doing a haul with. I have more stickers coming so I'm just kind of stacking them there for the moment. Um, over here I have this really cool washi cart and a bunch of Simply Gilded washi. You gotta have hand cream, especially now when we're all washing our hands like crazy. And then over here, I've got some calendar setups. So this is from Erin Condren. Those planners are from Erin Condren as well. Um, but this is from Erin Condren. This was just kind of keeping track of my vlogging and things like that and like what I needed to film. So today is actually the 28th. Um, I did a little bit of decorating, but not, not too much. So, um, yeah, today's the 28th, and then I'll be posting this, I don't know, at some point. Um, I actually got this acrylic uh, easel, like acrylic stand on Amazon uh, the other day, and I really like this a lot. Um, I like that that just, like, sits there, and I can see it, because I've got a lot of things going on. Um, so, yeah, like, th this is today, and I'm down here filming filming things some filming things so yeah but that's that um over here is just some stuff i need to deal with this is some ups returning labels that um i still need to hold on to until amazon credits my account um i have like a little i call it a washi cutter it's not it's actually a um bookmark but i use it to cut washi i just leave it right here and then inside of here is a bunch of markers from Erin Condren. So we have that. I've got a little coaster because you need a coaster for all your good stuff. Um, I also have some just random sticky notes. I was writing some sticky notes that I gotta put away, but whatever. And then I have a new pad of sticky notes. Um, so I just always have a fresh pad of sticky notes ready. And then I have 
a bunch of um, pens. <laughs> I don't know, I just kind of put them in there. It's easy. I'm right-handed, so it makes sense when I'm at my all my monitors that I have it on the right side. Um, I also have my phone, and it's on a little stand right now. It's being charged, but it's really easy to, like, you know, do this or have it sit like that, um, like for video calls or what have you. And then I also have a wireless keypad and mouse that all gets connected into this bad boy over here, which is my laptop. And then over on the side here, I have like a big pen holder, but um, you know, this doesn't really fit anywhere else on the desk. So I just put it over there. And then when I need pens, I just throw them in there because it works. Because I usually just use the same two or three over and over again. And if you guys are wondering, I got my desk at Ikea. I can't remember the name of it, but um, I had to, you know, everything was separate. So you got the file cabinets and then the top and the one leg all separately. So yeah. And then the chair I actually got on Amazon. I will link that below. And then I've got, I got like everything on Amazon for the most part. And then I've got this, which I actually got the other day. There you go make it look pretty for you. You can kind of make it look funny here. Um, but this is supposed to help with like, I don't know, your nerves or something. But anyway, I did read on the Amazon reviews that this can kind of stain your chair. So I put a Erin Condren Sherpa throw down so it didn't stain the white. Um, anyway, but it seems to be working just fine and I really like it. And then underneath my chair, I actually have um, a foot roller because I have plantar fasciitis in my feet and uh, that helps. <laughs> um, moving over here, I have all my cords, which is like a hot mess, but they are, it's a labeled hot mess, you guys. Um, and then I have my paper shredder. I've got my printer, which I really don't need to use, to be honest, for the most part, but every once in a while I do need to physically sign something and then scan it. So it's nice to have this, and this is a laser jet printer, and I absolutely love it, and I've had it for a few years now, and I really, really like it. As for the file cabinet, it's a three-tiered file cabinet, also from Ikea. Had it for several years now. Um, this tiered cart is from Ikea. Everything's from Ikea, you guys. And this is my planner cart that has all my stickers and all my washi and sticky notes and all my little doodads to decorate my planner, which is right over here. So, um, you know, when I need to put something in my planner or whatever, I can just wheel the cart over um, and plan. And then over here is nothing really interesting. I have these two bookcases. They're the Billy bookcase. Uh, and this is what the inside looks like. I really don't have much going on in either of them. Um, this used to be storage for my Etsy shop, which is no longer in business because it was just too much. I didn't need to do that anymore. So I just said sayonara and this is all the extras. And then on top here, I just have a little bit of tissue, another um, little organizer. This one is from Home Goods, And then I've actually got some... Like these are, these two are like work notebooks and then I have another work um, thing here. This is a medical binder and then this is also a medical like binder slash tracker. So that's basically it for my at home work setup. Um, I try not to eat up here, but it's really, I feel like it's super difficult right now just with everything going on. What I'd like to do is, um, work, when I'm working from home, there's a dog right there, is I like to take him on a nice long walk, usually about like 10, 1030, somewhere in there. Um, that kind of just helps my brain. Like I, you know, in the morning I check my email, I get all my emails out, do all of that good stuff. And then once it kind of dies down just a little bit, I'll take him out for just a little bit of a mental break, you know, like a 15 minute walk, something like that. He's getting really excited when I'm saying the word walk. Um, anyways, and then, um, yeah, grab some water or whatever, take my coffee or tea or whatever I'm drinking for the morning 
and um oh don't really your curse um and then uh take that downstairs and then um you know bring up bring up some water or juice or whatever i want to drink and uh you know kind of reinvigorate a little bit so um yeah but uh let me back up a little bit here you know back that train up here come on Doyle. so yeah that is it for my working at home office setup i hope you guys enjoyed the video and enjoyed just a little look at the office i you know don't use too much pen to paper except for my little notes i do have to write myself little notes once in a while but that's about it. Everything is digitized. I send over all my completed work um, actually to my boss. He goes from there because he's actually in the office right now. I think he's he is the actually the only person in the office. Um, everyone else is working in production and they're taking all their precautions and things like that and they actually all work more than six feet away from each other. So not sure when I'm actually going back into the office. That has not been announced yet, but um, yeah, I'll try to get this video up for you guys. And then I will, like I said before, I will link as many products as I can find down below. Um, and then if you have a home office set up, do you have any like tips or tricks or little things that really help you? Um, you know, like the dog helps me because it kind of breaks up the day and things like that. Um, but yeah, right? Doyle, do you help me? Do you like all of his bones, by the way? They're just sitting there excited. He's just an excited guy, but yeah, he's got he's got several bones just hanging out over here. Just just waiting for him. <laughs> anyway, okay, this is getting long-winded. Sorry about that, guys. All right, I'm going to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe, and I will be back for more content very, very soon. Bye, guys. You want to say bye? No. Okay. Talk to you later, guys. Bye. Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school.